for what? Not even, you know, full, almost three, not even two and a half weeks or whatever it's been. So, um, you know, the, the guy just went out into another jog through and was able to call a lot of plays that he's never called before. I mean, every single day is truly a learning process um, from an information standpoint to be able to regurgitate that information to then be able to go and execute the information. So I think he's done a really nice job. I mean, um, some things in the game the other night, I think, you know, we, we could have liked to have back, but also we've also got to make some plays around him and, and be able to execute um, with all 11. So um, I, I think he's done a really nice job so far. Yeah. Underneath concepts, how crucial can those be, if at all? For sure. Establishing rhythm and, and tempo. That's, that's big. I mean, you know, we missed one on the sack. You know, we ended up kind of having Van on the sideline. And, you know, Ben was on a crossing route. And, um, you know, we ended up kind of taking a sack there where we had some check downs. And that's just learning because there's plays where, um, you know, there's one where he hit Cam on the check down that went for about eight or nine on the sidelines. Well, he knew exactly where his check down was going to be. Um, and we kind of tweaked the play to give him a little bit of a different check down on the one we ended up taking a sack on. And for us as coaches, we're like, well, all right, well, how can we just make it so tight for him that he knows exactly where his outlets are um, and try to create as much clarity for some of those underneath uh, flare control plays that we're talking about. And um, to be able to get those things thrown and caught, especially in you know normal down situations, um, those are huge because it just keeps the ball moving forward and um, you know doesn't put us in any get back on track situation. So yeah, just trying to be able to be a little bit more efficient with the quick games, you know, some of the underneath and you know checking the ball down in rhythm and timing is definitely important. You know, as you you know I've seen when we do check the ball down when we get play action, typically uh, we're a little bit more efficient. Does that type of consistency help out the line? Yeah, because the ball also comes out. You know, when you, when you check it down, you don't have to be on four hitches waiting for a long play to develop, and then, oh, man, I have to check it down. If you get into a situation where the coverage does not, uh, isn't what we were looking for right off of the exchange, you can check the ball down in rhythm a little bit more to where the O-line doesn't feel like it's a, uh, a long down, where they can get the, we can get the ball out of our hands, check it down, and it'll be a similar thought process with a similar structured defense that we're going up against this week. Uh, I mean, it's first play of the game, right? He had three stiff arms, you know, in one, one play. I mean, you just saw Cam, I think, over the last few weeks start to uh, get into a little bit of a rhythm. I mean, it's, he's coming off, of, you know, injuries, coming off of a uh, difficult season and all these different things. Well, um, if you're looking for positives, you're looking for consistency and production, he's starting to come along a little bit. Obviously, we're later in the year, but it's great to have – Cam back making some plays, and um, it's fun to watch. When he's going, um, it, it's really fun to be a part of. And, um, you know, there's things like every player that you want to be able to have back, reads, cuts, whatever it is. Uh, at the end of the day, he was productive the other night and um, hopefully continue to use that going into this, game, into this game and for the next few games. But um, when he's productive and he's making plays, um, things are usually good. You also saw uh, from a coaching staff – we put him out in some empty formations, and he might not have been the primary on those, but his detail without the ball the other night was, was also improved, and it has been improved actually over the last few weeks. So you just see some, some detail starting to show up, some things that he's, you know, we've been kind of on him about over the last, you know, for the whole season, and he's, you know, running through some tackles, which is helpful. Nice. Oh, wow. 